Hello again. I'm Joey Manigo with Georgetown County Parks and Recreation. I've been officiating for 20 years with the Recreation Department and the South Carolina High School League. Today, we're going to discuss the passing game. The first thing that we want to talk about is the differences between the high school rules and the pro rules. Let me give you one example. The definition of a catch. In high school, you need to have, what we look for is one foot inbound. In the pros, you have to have two. So we can understand sometimes when you get confused about that. The second thing we want to talk about is pass interference. At the high school level, you can face guard, which means you can have your hand in front of this receiver's face. At the next level, that would be called pass interference on Sunday. The other thing we want to talk about is a forward pass. What's the definition of a forward pass? The definition of a forward pass is that it's going forward, whether it's behind the line of scrimmage, as we say, or you pass it and it goes beyond the line of scrimmage. But let's be clear about this. You can have what may appear to be two forward pass. If initially the quarterback gets the ball, turns and throws it backwards, that would be considered a lateral or what we call a backward pass. The individual or the player that catches that backward pass or lateral, then they can throw it forward. Go online and try to find the rules for offense and defense on within the passing game. Please comment or get a hold of us on Facebook. And please keep active by downloading the app NFL Play 60. Have a good day. Thank you.